Good evening, folks, and here's an article from Jason Schreier that came out just a few hours ago on Bloomberg. That's where he works now. And it's about EA's decision to determine what's going to happen to Anthem from Bioware this week. They're going to have a meeting about it and determine whether or not they're going to pull the plug or keep it going, which is fascinating because this is something which should have been figured out, well, <laughs> a long time ago. But uh, apparently this is the week to do it. There's, there's nothing else. This is what's going to happen. Uh, fun times for Bioware and Anthem because, God, we've been waiting for this thing to go away. They can focus on products they're actually good at or services and products they actually want people to, to experience and buy and play. Like, I don't know, a certain multiplayer game that came out uh, eight, nine years ago from one of their most popular franchises, which they're not releasing in their re-release of that series. Anyway... EA will hold a meeting this week to determine whether it continue to trying to create a new version of a failed online game, Anthem. This is a th second or third new version of Anthem? I don't remember. There's been so many reiterations, I can't remember the version numbers and what they keep changing. Whether it's the item drops, the types of items, the weapons, the flying, I don't remember anymore. So back in May, uh, executive producer Christian Daly wrote a bunch of blog posts about what they had planned. And I don't know if you guys remember that. I wrote a, or did a video about that just because of how hilarious it was. Because, well, you know, this, this image does not sell me on confidence <laughs> that they know it. Of course, this is in May. This is during the height, not the height, but the ramping up of COVID. So a lot of problems going on. So in this blog post, he has about a 30-man team who are incubating and focusing on just this project. So they've been going at this for almost a year now. And guess what? Christian Daly, in case you guys don't remember, left Anthem back in December, as did Casey Hudson and a bunch of other guys. So, yeah. Um, things things mix, got mixed up there. So this week, EA exec executives will review the latest version of Anthem Next. That's what they're calling it. Oh, God. And decide whether to expand the team or abandon the project, said the people who asked not to be named discussing private info. The Anthem Next team includes about 30 people, as we learned from May. People familiar with the project said it will need to expand or at least triple that. Wow. In order to produce new content and continue attempting to overhaul the game, he has not yet indicated whether it's willing to commit that kind of budget to revive a maligned game. So this is where EA goes, okay, we're not making any money. Your product's a pile of crap. We're going to cut it. Now, if for whatever reason they find value in this project, like some opportunity to make money, to excite the fans, whatever, uh, this, is, this is the week. This is what... This is the time for the producer on Anthem Next to sell EA on. Say, yes, yes, sir, we're all, everything's ready to go. We just need more money. We need triple the amount of people to get this going. So the spokesman for EA does comment on rumor and speculation. Anthem Next includes major changes to the game's core systems and interface. It's not clear if or when these changes will be implemented in the version that's currently available. So we don't know, even if this does go through, how they're going to release this game, whether it's going to be a brand new thing, whether it's going to be an iterative process, meaning they'll release version 2 and then version 2.1. We don't know. No one has any idea. So the examples that we always talk about is No Man's Sky and Final Fantasy fourteen because those were projects that had horrible launches and then they completely came back years later. So that's what we're hoping to see with Cyberpunk 2077 uh, come this month or next month. I can't remember when the next update's coming, but we've been waiting for that for Anthem for a while now. And this is the week we find out whether it's going to happen or not. So anyway, that was all the news. Hopefully we'll find out soon. Thanks for listening. Have yourself... Have a great day.